Yeah. How long since I've seen? I haven't seen you in years. I was just man. thinking about that as uh, as you walk by. I haven't seen you. By the way, you look great. I, Thank I, you. I, I didn't know you lost all this weight. I haven't seen you in a while since yeah. maybe the Dice Clay uh, years. Maybe. And that's got to be two thousand four, maybe since, or since we did a gig together. Yeah, I didn't know. <laughs> we were in Vegas together, mm -hmm. and uh, you and Jim had opened up for him multiple times prior right. to uh, me doing it. So I didn't know the whole dice thing of like you go to the mall. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you had to do the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. You know, you go shopping. Yeah, you know, like, you know, like I'm in Vegas with dice, and I'm like, this is gonna be great. <laughs> we're gonna go to the pool. We're gonna go to nightclubs, and he's like, no, we're gonna go shop for. Couches. <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> so, uh, yeah. <laughs> It's very disappointing, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> and did he make you buy like uh, XL hoodies to match his? He's got the weirdest idea of of friendship. He's such an odd guy. Uh -huh. I love him. Like, he changed my life. Oh yeah. But you, how long did you tour with him for? Two years, and uh, yeah, we would do this uh, XL. Like we would go to uh, Harley Davidson. Yep. That would be his spot. And he'd just go, uh, you know, take it. You know, uh, <laughs> <laughs> you hey, no, I get the uh, pro deal. That's right, the pro deal. <laughs> you remember the pro deal? I certainly do. <laughs> yeah, Dice would just go in there and steal. <laughs> <laughs> he would. He just ten billion dollars. He's just stealing fucking hoodies. <laughs> so what'd you do? You just go in the store, you put it on, you walk out. Well, I wouldn't do it. I didn't do it. I said, Dice, I can't do this. So uh, yeah, we had a lot of good times together. Yeah, he's a fun guy, man. Yeah. He's a really fun dude. Doesn't he love sweets? Oh my god. <laughs> you ever go, you, you ever go to a candy store oh, with him? Oh man. Go to Kansas, we'll work out, then we go get a Slurpee. <laughs> <laughs> Should we be drinking like a protein shake? <laughs> so, uh, yeah. We, I think uh, the best stories, too, are that, that he goes into open houses and just runs up and down the steps and shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's just crazy. But this is what happens when you don't drink. You know what I mean? Like, if you're not on the road drinking, what else are you going to do? Right. You got to find other shit yeah. to make you happy and make you feel good about, yeah. Ridiculous or, or, shit. Yeah. Yeah. But he would do that. He would he'd work out, and this is before I worked out, and he would have fucking Kenny or Happy Face, and they would have to have a giant Starbucks that, with the whipped cream and the extra <laughs> mocha chips. He would fucking extra mocha. He's really draining. And uh, he would have this giant chocolate treat afterwards. But any calories he burned working out, he would just immediately get them back. And add. <laughs> you can't work out and have a fucking 1,800 calorie <laughs> beverage. <laughs> but he was a fun guy, man. And you learned the crowd, how they treat you, the audiences. I always had decent success with them uh yeah it was tough it was one of those things where i got actually thrown off a little bit where i ended my set early and i came off and he he wasn't happy at all he's like what are you doing you know no matter how bad it's going you finish your time so you know i mean it was like uh, why didn't they like you he wasn't dice. It wasn't yeah. dice. Yeah. <laughs> it was. It was. I got out there, and uh, it was a hostile crowd. They wanted to see him, and it threw my act off and timing off. And I got off a little bit early, and he set me straight. Which uh, you know, I learned. Like I said, I learned a lot. You know, working with him and his crowds, and uh, and touring with him. So, yeah, it was. It was a great experience. I, I don't know. I grew up watching dice. So he was always th theatrical in his dress. Yeah, new, new he, leather coat every uh, special. Yeah, every yeah. special. Mm -hmm. I think that the best dice leather coat was the MTV Music Awards with the with the the black and white zebra. Oh my yeah. god! <laughs> yeah. Yes, yeah, it was oh like a fucking god. something. It was like a, it was like a rug in Scarface. <laughs> <laughs> there he is, just like vertical oh, straps yeah, running right. out. He's the man. <laughs> oh, is that nice? That's He's the statement. man. He really was. He was. He wore it without shame and comfortably, and it just yeah. worked.